Oh my goodness. Got a big sponge around the bend up here. Wow. This one's more of a barrel shape. Like the polypagon sponge. Polyoptagon? Yeah, polyoptagon. Yeah, is that the one? Is that this one? Could be. I know that is a sponge. <laughs> wow. I'm gonna zoom on that, Dave. Can really see all the fine features in here. Sponges, of course, are filter feeders. They move water through their pores. They're called the peripherans. They have these pores that they filter water through and little hairs inside called cilia that actually can grab onto particles that they then shift to their stomach to process. So, so really efficient filter feeders. All is their things. stomach like in a central location or is it all throughout their body? I believe that there's feeding cells all throughout. So I shouldn't really say a stomach. I think they... Oh no, it's fine. You can say a stomach. <laughs> It's so only our human-centric view that puts the stomach in one place. It does seem kind of inefficient, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. Anything special about these rocks, Adam? Uh, uh, well, so the yeah, I mean, we say every rock is special, so... It's a rare one. These ones are... Yeah, these will be very cool to take a look at. I don't. We don't have any samples from from this area. Another large sponge here. Are we seeing any critters on this one? Any shrimp? Oh, zoom in, Dave. And so on one of the ones we saw previously, there is a small red shrimp that was living on it. And it looks like there's some smaller things attached to the substrate around this sponge. We often take it for granted that it's just the sponge itself or the coral itself, but finding more and more that there's bridge, bridge now. all sorts of relationships meters, between south, species. Please. Oh, look at that. This looks like the ocean's satellite dish. <laughs> <laughs> it's really pretty. Look at that, those structures that are running through there. They all have different structures. What is it in there? They could be little, little snails, perhaps. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah that's big. what they look like. Yeah, little snails. Big. Wow, good idea. Not very yeah. big. Yeah. We're up close and personal here. Those are tiny. Look at that. That's amazing. <laughs> Like we've said, these corals and sponges are habitat for other species down here. That's even these itty bitty tiny ones. And they probably have entire host of microbes as well that um, support their functions. Okay, moving on. Moving, moving on. on. To the south, please. 